Hi, I'm Mike and this is Malcolm, the inventor of our patented wire strainer or wire tensioner. As you can see, it's a very simple and robust construction with no moving parts at all. And it's manufactured locally from locally sourced products and we then galvanize it to give it extra durability in life. Over the next uh, minute or so, we're going to show you how to apply the tensioners, what tools to use and how they can speed up your fencing requirements. Firstly, place the tensioner onto the wire through the central slot and put it on so that it hangs freely on the loop. Then put your tightening tool into the tensioner and begin to twist. And as soon as you've got sufficient tightness, then go slightly past the wire with the ends of the tensioner and then release it and let it come back and hook the two ends onto the wire. And of course, any time the wire goes slack, you can just give it another half turn to tighten it up again. Holding the tensioner horizontal, push one piece of wire through from the top and give it a slight bend. Get the other piece of wire and push that up through the bottom and give that a slight bend. And then simply tighten as you would if you were tightening a single piece of wire. Cut off the excess ends and tighten as much as you need to get the correct tension on the wire. Place the handle into the tensioner, wind it up to the level of tightness that you require. The other option is to use a standard crescent, hook that into the tensioner and use that to tighten it. The other option is a standard fitting that fits onto a normal half inch drive ratchet and that fits into the tension in exactly the same way as the other tool and you can also use that to tighten the wire.